Good morning guys, how's it going? It has been a long time since I've done just a conventional uh, vlog, just a daily vlog showing you what's going on around here. Uh, it's been an interesting last few weeks. I um, hope you guys have enjoyed the last few videos. Um, so we got the two helicopters out right now. We got the Schweitzer on the end because uh, Simon is flight testing today. And um, so we, he's going to be doing that in the Schweitzer today. <laughs> How are you feeling there, Simon? Uh, very good. <laughs> we uh, just got an update from Lyle. Lyle says he's going to be here in about uh, 45 minutes or so for the flight test. You're not feeling nervous, are you? No, no, no not at all. No. Rock solid. Okay, that's good. Uh, we're just checking on the weather situation. Um, this morning we had two miles of visibility because of all the smoke outside, which you guys can sort of see out there. And uh, so now it's nine. We just wanted to see what the update was. So if you guys ever want to check aviation weather, um, you Google AWWS, which stands for Aviation Weather Website. Um, you go here. I don't know if you guys are going to be able to read this because it's all encrypted. Uh, we're going to go CYXX for the meat tires and tafts. CYXX is Abbotsford Airport. And well, that's interesting. That's a new symbol right there. <laughs> what does that mean, Mr. Flight Test Man? That's a variable between 0 0.1 and 0 0.9 knots. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what that means? <laughs> I think so, yeah. That's, that's a symbol I've never seen before, actually. Um, that's very intriguing. Anyways, we're still at three miles. I was hoping to see more than three miles. Um, and then we've got the smoke and everything else. Yeah, scattered clouds at 3,000. Yeah, it hasn't gotten much better since the last report we looked at. All right, so another day with uh, George. George is back again. Uh -huh. And uh, we're heading back up to Breakin Ridge for round another two. round. Round two, exactly. It's still summer, still warm out. So we'll see if we can get up for another week. Uh, you're, yeah, it's almost a week, right? Today's Tuesday. Yeah, picking up next Tuesday. Yo, so bro. another week. Yo. Yeah, see if we can pack all this gear in the helicopter again. Well, we managed to fit it all in as usual. The uh, left side is packed right to the roof. Everything else is packed up. Should be good to go. All right, get packed in there. Next thing you know, we'll be on the top of Breaking Ridge. All right, so we are up here on the top of Breaking Ridge. And it's a smoky but beautiful day up here. We're going to a new spot. We're usually down on the island over there. Um, but we're going to go to a new spot up over here. What do you think? You're back in your, uh, in your element. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Vacation time. Vacation time, exactly. Well, let's get unpacked. Uh, full to go, eh? Everybody needs a toilet seat when they're up here. <laughs> uh, I'll leave that right there. Nice. You use that? You good? Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna try it right now. Okay, let's try it out. Yeah. <laughs> Woo! Yeah. Uh, what network are you on, Rogers? I'm on Rogers. Yeah. Ah, uh, perfect. I'm on Rogers also. Perfect. Well, we got it all unpacked. Nice spot. Look at this up here. And again, no wind. Yep. What is with this? Every time we come up here, there's no wind. It's crazy. Always, always around uh, 12 o'clock, it moderates. Okay. And uh, then about 6.30, it starts picking up again. Ah, uh, I see. So I don't know if you guys remember one of my first ever vlogs. Sorry, there's a little bit of wind over, over on this side of the ridge now, but one of my first vlogs was snowboarding down a glacier. If you guys haven't seen that, check it out. It's like at the very, very beginning. And this is the glacier right here on the side of Mount Breaking Ridge. Pretty safe, uh, no, no crevasses on this slope here. And uh, ends in this beautiful lake, which I can't quite get far enough over to show you guys, but just gorgeous up here. You see, I know this, but the last days in real life I've noticed. Losing focus, breaking up from our life as we know it.
All right, George. See ya. See you, George. Se va por la, por la orilla por mucho tiempo. Mucho de por dentro. <laughs> mucho tiempo. Here we got the Mexican hour with uh, Misha here. Yeah, that's right. I know zero Mex or uh, Spanish, so not, not going to help. Uh, just out with Seb again here and his friends in the back. Uh, introduce yourselves again. I, uh, I'm forgetting your name, sorry. I'm Daniel and I'm Jaime. Okay, awesome. Um, we're just going out on a flight up to probably Mount Robbie if we can get to it. This is the view that we've got right now. Um, Seb, how many miles do you think of visibility that is? Uh, that's uh, no more than two, maybe three at the max, but... Yeah, I would say it's definitely three miles. Yeah. I, I wouldn't say it's as low as two, but it's not pretty. Definitely not great. Um, once we get up a little further north, it clears up just a tiny bit. So we'll see if we're going to be able to get up to Mount Robbie today. All right, so we just landed up on the ledge here on Mount Robbie, and now we're working our way up to the top. Up to the Mira helipad. La allí. Oh, check out that uh, waterfall right there. Mira, uh, wow. wow. That's amazing. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Never gets old up here. That's for Never sure. Does, Never man. gets old. Look at those huge crevasses, eh? Just falling away off the edge. Amazing. I'll let you have that one. Oh. I shouldn't have, no. <laughs> oh, man. Nice, top of Mount Ravi. <laughs> Sweet. Wow. <laughs> Beautiful. Beautiful up here. Visibility is not that bad, actually. It's not bad. I mean, it's not great, but yeah, compared to what it was, it seems to be a touch better. What do you guys think? Uh, yeah. It's amazing. Yeah. <laughs> Loving it. We're top, excited. Top of the world up here, right? Yeah. 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 <laughs> nice. <laughs> Nothing like the, the nervous chuckles from the back seat <laughs> coming off the edge of the waterfall there. It took about three seconds and then the laughing started. <laughs> I liked it. <laughs> wow, this river is totally dried up down here. It's crazy. Look at that. There's no water left at all. How? When did that happen? I don't know. Where is the water going through? Because there's water down here a little further. I was uh, I was flying through here like a week ago, and this was like fully white water rafting. Yeah, like there's there's water there. I don't know where it went in that section back there. Interesting. Went underground to the underworld. <laughs> <laughs> and that wraps up another busy day. Uh, helicopters are all back in the hangar. Sanchente or pit crew in the R44 because it's due for a 50-hour inspection. Um, I was really hoping to catch Simon before he took off home, um, give him a little post-flight uh, post test debriefing. He passed his flight test, it was exciting, um, he did really well, and so it was great to see that. Um, maybe on the next video I'll uh, get a little interview with him, just to see what his thoughts were on the flight test. Um, busy day today, lots of flying, it was great, um, good to be back to a regular vlog. Um, hopefully I'll be doing this again for Thursday's vlog. And um, we'll catch you guys next time. Thanks so much, by the way, for uh, sharing the last video I did with the, uh, the forest fires. Um, that got a lot of shares. Probably um, it was my second highest shared video. So it was really neat to see you guys um, just collabing together and um, posting that out on Facebook and everything. It was pretty cool to see. So um, hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and uh, share. Uh, subscribe if you haven't. And we'll talk to you guys next time.